they will come and tell you it's, abandoned, it's an abandoned property. It is never going to happen. Make sure you have your the document of your property intact. Take them with you. Run back to Biafra land and let us do the job for you at the end of the day. I promise you, none of Biafra property, none, I mean none, not even one room that you have a document that we're going to leave behind. We will fight Nigeria even after this freedom has been restored. We will still engage Nigeria until we are satisfied that what they have done to us, we have gotten them back. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Now the floor is open for donations and picking up Kula Not. Everyone should support um, Northern Nigeria Biafra Lizen. Everyone should support Northern Nigeria Biafra Lizen. And from today, the Prime Minister has uh, upgraded their name from Northern Nigeria to Northern Nigeria Biafra Lizen. So we address them as such going forward. Uh, Obi, your hand is up. Unmute yourself, Obi. Obi, unmute yourself. Obi, unmute yourself. The floor is open for question and answers from all angles. Ask the Prime Minister any question you want. Make your donation, support. Northern Nigeria Biafra Lizen. Speak cool or not. And ask your questions. Obi, unmute yourself. Obi. Obi, unmute yourself. Um, William Nameka, unmute yourself. Please, if you want to speak, you have to raise your hand. Tap on the reactions button or the reactions icon then you will see an option that says raise hand then you raise your hand that's how you can raise your hand williams nameka you have the mic speak up please thank you my honorable minister of information i greetings to my pm extraordinary ebubedike one he cook himself the quagmire of the zoo. Welcome to uh, Northern Nigeria. Please, may I take um, Osoji for you? You know, when people came and started no Osoji and they are nowhere to be found any longer. So I'm taking Osoji for you with 100,000 AJ. I will send it through my SA. Thank you for, 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 for rescuing us. Thank you for, you know, being the hand of God upon our lives. Thank you, my PM. I greet you all the cabinet. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, Thank you my dear. Thank you. We call on um, Ebuka. He is in Achi. Ebuka, he is in Achi. Unmute yourself. When I say unmute yourself, look at the screen of your device. You will see a pop-up command which says the host wants you to unmute yourself. You click on unmute. Ebuka, unmute yourself. Obi, unmute yourself. AGK Emmanuel, unmute yourself. AGK Emmanuel, unmute yourself. HK, you have the mic. Good evening, dear friends. Good evening, the Minister of Information. Am I coming out? Yes, we can hear you. Right on, right on. Good evening, the Prime Minister of Biafra government in Ezai. I greet you, sir. You are indeed a man of the people. Without you, I don't think uh, some of us here in Nigeria will be here. But we thank God who brought you in this time. You're welcome, sir. Hello? 
Hello. Can you hear me? HK, continue to speak, HK. We can hear you. Don't stop. Continue. Okay. Yes. Uh, this is my first time speaking with my PM and every one of you over there. I'm glad and happy to be here. Even though what we are hearing and what we are seeing in Nigeria is something that uh, nobody will uh, advise anybody to do things that will make Nigeria a, a place that people will live in. Uh, without being wasting much of the time, I've been following our Prime Minister right from the day he interviewed our leader, Mazunam de Kano. And uh, even though things are not being the way it's supposed to be, but uh, I've been praying and interceding the little I can to make sure and to ask God to help us to achieve this aim like what he always said that we are going to give freedom to our unborn children they will not go into face what we are facing today i thank him for all the things he has been doing to us doing for us i thank him for making sure that uh, our land is safe we know what is happening in Nigeria. Many things are happening both in the northern side where we are, where we are today. But uh, he never allows us to happen in Biafra. Thank you very much, my PM. So uh, uh, I want to do, give us to my PM, the little I can offer, so that as subsequent time and uh, Maybe I would like information minister to give me any contact within this area. I'm presently in uh, the capital of Nigeria. Uh, who, how I will be getting orders like liaison officer and co. So that uh, with time we will be participating and doing the little we can. I'm welcoming our PM with 5,000 AJ. Thank you very much and God bless you all. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Mind you, go please uh, post our number, our numbers again on the comment section of this Zoom. So anyone making donation and you don't know you how will to help me. It, contact us with the number that you will see there. We will forward you to the uh, reps in any of the regions. Thank you. Thank you, sir. All right. We go to the next person, Master GK. Thank you. Standing by Obi, have you unmuted yourself? Obi, Obi, you have if you have disabled your microphone, you can't speak. Okay, Sipra and Ugochuku, over to you. Sipra and Ugochuku, over to you. Uh, those those who don't know who is the admin in any part of uh, Nigeria that's Cora, like the brother that just spoke now, go to the comment section. In the I have posted the number, so contact any of those numbers. And then you'll be guided. Hello. Yes, Mark, right on, we can hear you. We can hear you. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, but to be I greet you, sir. I greet everyone. The media, I greet you. Uh, all the VLA, we are seeing what you are doing. Oh, but to be you know, safe. Since where you come, Lagos. Come, come. Can't go back since that time. My level for Lagos because uh, since uh, uh, I talk to them, they know they here. But when you now visit Lagos, finish. I will put an honor. I greet you, sir. Well done, sir. <laughs> you know, say for Lagos, uh, I be I be for Zugeria. When you come a place like this, if they get some uh, area boys where they come, come harass harass more. They they carry something, take give them and go. We are going to do better here. So I they use uh, two thousand a jet. Where they make you take a make a uh, or small. Make it make a. Uh, <laughs> welcome, sir. I greet you. Well done, sir. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, Majesty Brian. We go to Sylvester Agada Sunday. 
the best I got a Sunday on Mitch yourself. Sylvester, I got a Sunday on Mitch yourself. A Buka, he see not she on Mitch yourself. A Buka, can you hear me now? Yes, I can hear you. Okay, I greet my Ebu Prime Minister. In fact, I am very privileged for the first time to, to speak through this medium to, the, to our Prime Minister one on one. I've been following him even right from the, before the, uh, the uh, kidnapping of our, our union. In fact, uh, what he's doing, in fact, he said God has chosen him to, to take up this, uh, uh, this world of task. We, we thank you for the good work that you are doing. You are saving a lot of life of uh, of Biafra. So, and I want also to thank the entire members of the uh, Biafra government in exile. So, I want to thank uh, Sonny Aparawa also. They have been doing wonderful. So, I'm uh, where I am now. It's raining seriously. I am uh, I am based in the capital of Adamawa. In fact, I don't have. There's nobody here that I can. You know, they ask you, but we have, there are a lot of people who are always coming on uh, on, uh, on on that, on Zoom like this to listen to our Prime Minister. So, but for me, I'm very privileged today that uh, I'm I'm part of. I want to make myself, you know, to be part of the history. So, without wasting much of time, I want to uh, give uh, also to our. Prime Minister with a sum of uh, ten thousand Egypt. So, yeah. and I will also, I would like the team to a uh, kind of uh, join me with uh, a very close um, Lazim uh, office, maybe like in Paraba, right, where I can, you know, forward my donation. So, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, Mazi. Thank you. We go to okay zero zero two zero four two. Okay, okay please, zero, uh, Ibo, please zero, uh, uh, Sonny. Sonny, the, the person that just spoke now from Adama. Uh, please collect the number. Collect the number from uh, uh, the chat session, and uh, so that you can be connected okay. to the, to any admin uh, closer to you. Okay. All right, thank you, Prime Thank you. Okay, Zia Ebo 041, meet yourself. Okay, Zia Ebo 041. Yes, you have the mic. Yes, can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you right on. Am I coming out? We can hear you, we can hear you. Continue. Okay, good afternoon, my team. Uh, good afternoon, uh, my Ebo Minister, and thanks for making us coming. I greet you, everybody. My team, I welcome you today in the North of Nigeria. Uh, but before I, I do what to do, I just want to say something because I was supposed to send a message that I wasn't able to come online when you just said my own face, uh, which is Lagos. So I've been trying to do possible means to get uh, how to connect myself back to. The person in charge in Lagos, but I thought I'll make sure I'm available on today's uh, visit in the northern Nigeria. So I say welcome, but uh, I want to use uh, that uh, also I don't see anything more. I saw me the south side and it did the same Lagos to the Lagos. If you see a place, I didn't see my car. Come back and I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Lagos to the car to Lagos. So then, uh, I I did my son. I did my son. Did I put now? I saw. 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 Yeah, I can't 
We are not hiding anything. So, Mana, if you have a question, you ask. Uh, what we are doing, I'm working, I'm working on the ground. Then we are on a case in Mia. We are on a case in Mia. We are on a case in freedom. It is either you are doing it or you are not doing it. Thank you, Mahazi. Please, everyone that does not know how to remit their payment, remember to pick the numbers of the media team and the comment session and follow us up. Uh, Boyoyo, Boyoyo, unmute yourself. Boyoyo, unmute yourself. You have the mic. Good afternoon, Via France. Am I being heard? Greeting. Yes, I can hear you. Continue. Special, special greeting to my Prime Minister, Mazi Salman, Ukuromo, Obatovi, Neluka Mokesi Ama, Emaka, Tagazi, Regis, Mr. Information. Pastor Van Van Van, you are cited. I make a lonely name. Oh, no, I jam mono. I issue now, I would demonstrate now, or Mona or for the Umunum never. Yeah, I we we thank you all. Or had you precisely, or had you precisely in all you must teach. And we will go to the comment session after my after speaking, then we will look for the the contacts on how to uh, tender our 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 the donations. So um, my PM, our question here something we are being we are confused. We want to ask uh, this question. Now uh, we understand that we are in, in over the state, yes, over the state in, in, in the United States of Biafra. But we have, we don't know uh, any of the admin uh, where we can get uh, uh, info except from these meetings or the other space meeting that we join. So it is with it, 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 the Uh, the same thing you will. This you will is really giving us a worry. So the media, yeah. the media, if you are deprooted in the struggle, you will know your admins and all that. But however, you can reach out to the to the media, and they will uh, interview you and link you up to your state. Did you hear me? You know the queer? Okay, all the Kazoo network, it's a TPA game. 
All right, next. All right, we go to the next person. Uh, Diana, over to you, please. All right, wonderful people. Welcome back to this wonderful channel where we bring you back-to-back -back updates and information as CD Hot. In case you have not joined our social media and what are you waiting for, kindly go ahead and subscribe, like, comment, share, and also remember to on your notification button so that whenever our news drop, you will be the first. We'll collect them. Let's go down to the news proper as CD Hot. You don't share it. As the NIG army them boys don't do what in no good for village of Omunze in Anambra State as the Nigerian soldiers invaded church uh, in Omunze. These past worship worshippers uh, will be say they there for that place. Omunze there for Orumba South local government area of Anambra State. Uh, please, if you are here part of our followers if you are following us on this channel and um uh, you are from omunze orumba south local government area please kindly comment on the comment section let's know the situation of what is happening down there on in omunze as soldiers has been accused of invading churches in omunze there as it is they also disperse the worshippers that are there but as it is uh, the nig soldiers nig uh, army nigerian army has dismissed that report as false first of all before i go down to the full detail of the information on what happened at that omunze i want to ask first has there been any point in time that nigerian soldiers has taken responsibility of their their nonchalant act or their nonchalant attitude towards the citizens of this nation remember what happened some time ago in Olo, where a lot of youths who were going to a wedding ceremony uh, were sent to their early grave and other things that have happened in so many many places uh okuoma case and the rest of them uh, at every point in time the Nigerian military has always been on the defensive side. Without properly advising their troops, without properly advising their soldiers, without properly uh, uh, giving a proper instruction or carrying out an investigation. You know, one thing is that whenever these things come up, you will see that the, the, the head of the soldier will, will come up the next day and start defending his people. And I wonder, does it mean that these people cannot be able to carry out an investigation to be able to ascertain what actually happened? Meanwhile, let's go down to the full detail of the information. Let's go down to the full detail of the information on what happened there. A report surfaced last Sunday alleging that some soldiers invaded Catholic church churches and disperse worshippers at Omunze community in Orumba South local government area of Anambra State. The Nigerian army has dismissed as false a report that its troop invaded churches and dispersed worshippers from churches in Anambra State, Nigeria, Southeast. A report surfaced last Sunday alleging that some soldiers invaded some Catholic churches and dispersed worshippers at Omunze, a community in Orumba South local government area of the state. But responding to an inquiry by the news agency of Nigeria, the army spokesperson Onye Mawachuku refuted the report. Mr. Mawachuku, a major general, said the soldiers only conducted a cardon and search operation in the area and did not invade churches. He said the operation was conducted by troops of the 82th Division of Nigerian Army. The army spokesperson explained that the operation followed a tip off that the assailants who attacked and killed some troops earlier were receiving medical treatment in a house close to a Catholic church in the area. During the operation, the troops evacuated the people who were considered vulnerable if a shootout ensued to avoid collateral damage. The cordon and search on the community was to enable the troops to arrest some accomplices who escaped with gunshot wounds and bloodstained from the attack that killed two 
of the military troop, Mr. Wachuku said. He pointed out that although the tip off they got was that the assailants were receiving treatment within the house, the soldiers later realized that the suspects had already left the building before the operation. It is most unfortunate that the operation took place on Sunday, he said. The army spokesperson claimed that the deployment of the troops in the area was expedient because of increased case of kidnapping and ransom collecting by criminals in Omunze. He claimed that the deployment of troops in Omunze community has helped to reduce kidnap attacks in the area. The troop will continue to ensure the safety of all the citizens, he assured. Omunze like other communities in Anambra state has witnessed frequent attack by government said to be part of Biafra agitation in the region. The Biafra agitation has accused many casualties, has caused many casualties on the side of the ag agitators and the Nigerian security agencies including the army. In September 2022, for instance, government killed five soldiers in Omunze community in one of the brutal attacks in the area. In May last year, some armed person killed two, three police operatives at a chicken point in the community. The Nigerian government has accused the indigenous people of Biafra of being responsible for the deadly attack in the region. However, the group has reportedly denied any involvement in the attack. IPOB is leading the agitation for an independent state of Biafra, which it wants carved out from the southeast and some part of the south out Nigeria. All right, that's the full detail of that particular information there. Uh, Nigerian army has um, denied of uh, dispersing worshippers. According to them, uh, they say they were doing Operation Kodon and such uh, in order to be able to ascertain what is happening in that particular area of Omonze. Uh, that according to them, that there was a shootout uh, between the Nigerian soldiers and some unknown gunmen uh, which resulted to casualties to the side of the unknown gunmen and to them uh, they said according to them that there is information that those uh, who battled that battle with nigerian army who received gun wounds uh, were treating themselves close to the catholic church that soldiers entered and dispersed worshippers uh, they said they dispersed the people uh, to avoid uh, casualties okay uh, if you there for that two uh, drop your comment on the comment section. As it be, Chinese investors has taken over Nigerian guest house in UK to sell them on eBay for 3.4 billion naira, which is 22.2 million dollars. <laughs> oh, say Taylor, um, the country is going down. The ship keeps sinking, and nobody is doing anything. Let's go down to the full detail of the information. Uh, remember. Uh, that uh, here is 3.2 billion. That's the reason why these people want to sell uh, this building. But remember that the president just bought uh, his um, presidential jet that is worth 150 billion. A Chinese investment group, Zongzang uh, Fuchent Industrial Investment Limited, is set to list two residential structures. It confiscated from Nigeria for sale on global online marketplace eBay. According to a report from Papers Gazette, Zhang is racing to recover up to $70 million in arbitration award from NIFWEI. The group took possession of two buildings linked to the Nigerian government in Liverpool, United Kingdom, in June 2024 years after Nigeria failed to settle an arbitration judgment handed down in 2021. The properties, 15 Airbuck Hall Road, Liverpool and Beach Lodge, 49 Kedderstones Road, Liverpool, were targeted after a December 2021 British court order gave the Zan executive the power to see the Nigerian assets in the UK to retrieve the 70 million payment which remained outstanding as August 20, 2024, with 2% 2 monthly interest accruer. Zonshan was awarded fifty-five thousand six hundred and seventy-five 
million dollars plus interest of nine thousand four hundred million dollar and cost of two thousand and cost of two million eight hundred and sixty four thousand four hundred and forty five million pounds as of the date of the arbitration verdict on march 26 2024 court document said the case stemmed from a dispute between Zhang and Ogun State. The firm said the state violated a 2001 trade treaty between Nigeria and China when it tried to a free trade zone where resided in 2016. The company dragged Nigeria before the arbitration panel in the UK in 2018, alleging that Nigeria allowed its federal organs like the police, immigration, and exports processing authorities to be deployed by Ogun State without due process. Court documents said two Zanzan executives were expelled from Nigeria between mid-late 2016 after one of them had allegedly been detained and tortured by police. Um, my people, my people, they are too for the church, huh? Uh, election is low, la. Aloha na anobo na anobo, eh, tinubu galopo, pia asidebi. Meanwhile, remember that these Chinese folks are mining gold like waiting no good for Niger. Uh, but nobody they talk about that one. But not me go talk am. Um, you know go hear around from my mouth. Kemesiano, ngwangwano munne.